Hey guys, JDB Gaming here, and welcome. Oh dear, what has just gone on there? Okay, what a hell of an intro! I didn't even get through my my intro before it all kicked off. Hey guys, JDB Gaming here, and welcome to a brand new Survive the Hunt. We're here in GTA with the snow around, and I'm gonna quickly throw a snowball at Jack and no, knock him off. There we go. Oh, that didn't actually knock him off. That's a shame. Oh, quickly, before he attacks me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway, yes, we're here in. Um, GTA 5 doing another survive the hunt and it's snowing baby so uh yeah different challenge normally whenever it's been snowing I've done like a Christmas special or something along those lines for this one I'm not going to be doing anything Christmas it's not going to be like a designated Christmas special or anything this is just a it's a snow and a hunt and yeah that's pretty much it. I know I can hear some of you going, Oh, oh I wanted something different. I wanted some... Yeah, whatever I've done previously. Which is basically like a Halloween where I've done like... Not trick or treats, but whether or not it's been... A... Good present or a bad present. So the same idea, but just different words for the... Anyway, you know what I'm saying. No, not for this one. Just keeping it nice and simple. And... Yeah. Anyway, I need to think about where I'm going, where I'm placing my car. Um... Where am I placed? Oh, that's what I was going to do. So, in case you're I was unsure as what I'm on about, I have to go place my car somewhere that's not completely hidden, that is accessible from, by the hunters, because if they happen to find my car during the hunt and blow it up, I then have to instigate an immediate chase. So, it's sort of a, just a little bonus for the guys to have like a little mini game for them to do, and I'm going to place it by the helicopter spawn point, which I know is dangerous, because if the helicopter gets damaged at all and he wants to replace his helicopter, he can do so. And the helicopter spawn point is going to be where he's the chopper pilot is going to be going. Um, so we're placing it down here. I'm literally. So in theory, the hunters should be able to come across it. And I'm going to leave all the lights on. So at night time like now, you're going to see with all the... Oh, actually, it almost blends in a little bit. So here we go. Let's park it up right bang here does mean that I've got to do a little bit of a walk and I got going at midnight so they get going at 2am and nearly 2am is here so good to have to get a move on but yeah it's going to be an interesting one getting used to cars handling in the snow so for this one I'm definitely going to be aiming for uh, cars more towards the SUV 4x4 type range so not you because you're a rear wheel rear wheel drive car or they're saying that oh lovely you know what? We're gonna be cheeky. We're gonna take this truck. Oh, see what see what happens really with this truck. I can't remember if it's fast or not. Um, probably not. But hey, we're gonna give it a go. It's something different to do, isn't it? There's a lot of them spawning at the minute. It's not very quick, but it's gonna have the strength. And I assume it's. I don't know. We'll, we'll see, won't we? Maybe I'll stick for it for a few cars, maybe I won't. Speaking of cars, I need to show you the map. So whilst I'm changing my style, let's show the map and it can be a bit of a surprise. So we've got nine cars on offer today. Unfortunately, we were meant to have double figure hunters and someone dropped out last minute, but that doesn't stop us. We're gonna keep going. And so here are the nine cars, some dotted, some close together. Um, you're gonna come back to me because I struggled to find out where I'm going. Uh, I think I did that recently. So it's gonna be this style instead for today. And we're going to be driving an MTL Pounder. I don't know why, I just saw it and I thought, yeah, let's get some good vibes. The only thing with the snow is I can't judge the road, um, like, paintings and lines and stuff. It's really hard to judge those and you're going to give me away, so I'm going to get moved. They haven't got started yet, so we're all still... Oh, I'm really losing faith in this idea now. Really losing faith and quickly losing faith too. I don't know, it could be a good hunt, it could be a... Mm. <laughs> We'll see. We'll see. It's good. Okay. So, in terms of, obviously, the continuation from the previous survival hunt. So, the previous survival hunt you would have seen from this would have been number 55, if my memory serves me well. And what I mean by that is we now have a thing where, depending on if I survive the last hunt or not, impacts the next hunt. If you're not sure what I'm on about, basically, if I survive the hunt, the number of cars I have to get goes up by plus one. And then if I don't, it goes down by one, at a minimum of five. So I always have to get at least five cars. If I get the number of cars, so this time it will be six out of nine. So it will be a little bit trickier because we have one less car available and I've then gone up by one car. So technically it could almost be treated as like a... a you... why... it was green! Anyway. Oh, 
Oh, I don't feel safe in this. I just, just don't think it's anywhere near the city, is this vehicle? Oh, no, I just don't think it is. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and stay... I'm going to try and go back to the area I was in a second ago, because that's where I found it and some others will spawn. Anyway, so... Uh, what was I saying? What was my point? I've actually completely lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah, the number of cars. So... Spoilers, in case you haven't watched the previous survival hunt and you want to know whether or not I have survived or not. I think I've actually already said it, haven't I? Yeah, I might have. Oh, well, spoilers was a little bit too late. Yeah, I've got to get six out of the cars, so plus one because we survived the last one. So, yeah, I, that's pretty much what I was going to do. I, oh, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to fit under here. That's all good. So, yeah, we're just trying to figure out how to survive. <laughs> what am I saying? Come on, Jacob, figure it out. Um... I mean, I guess in exciting news, we have a brand new hunter joining us, um, which is always great news. And if you are on PlayStation and you like to, s the you want to get involved, we are always accepting applicants. You have to give me a written two-page documentary as to documentary document as to why you think you'd be a good fit with the group, what you'd have to offer to the survivors, uh, the hunters more so. And no, I'm joking, absolutely taking the mick <laughs> with nothing like that. Just give me a message if you like on my various different platforms, and we'll see about getting you in. Obviously, there's a bit of a trial period just to make sure, you know, everything's fine. You deal with the group and stuff like that. Um, and also because, unfortunately, just in the past, we have, have had people tend to not abide by the rules. Let's word it like that. Um, I mean, we haven't had those days for quite some time. And I, I trust my heart just wholeheartedly now. But, you know, unfortunately, a few raw eggs ruin the whole lot. Is that a saying? I don't know if it is, but anyway, yeah, we've got a brand new hunter. So, hey, woo, happy days. Um, which is always exciting. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything else I need to, to add. Um, so, I guess, uh, to be fair, with the, in, the increase of the car and the reduction of the cars, it's going to make it a bit trickier. So, and the reason we have that rule in is for that, how I technically survive the hunt. So, if I get all the cars listed, I can have a nice and easy you know just right out of time if not we've got to have to do a car park escape we haven't done you just went right why have you gone right into the back of me i was stopped dead honestly unbelievable right i want your insurance details because i'm not having you get away with hitting me in the rear and just driving away like nothing happened to be fair i think he probably killed himself by going into the back of me um right so one of the cars we can go for is the one that's at this car park which is this one here. The only thing is, I don't know where the car is, so I'm going to have to figure it out. I reckon it might be round the back of it, so I'm going to circle behind. Oh, I can hear chopper blades. I think the chopper as well is also going to have a rough time. I think when it's snowing, it's quite hard to see. Like, the visibility up high is not as great, so I think Hydro is going to have to fly lower than he would like to just so he can get a better view of the cars down below uh, I can't confirm or deny that I think this is just memory from when I've watched previous hunter footage like chopper footage in particular in the snow it's just yeah whatever <laughs> so yeah we're just getting there driving slowly we'll, you know we're seeing what we're going to do in a second hopefully we can get that first car ticked off that'd be great Again, nothing. I'm very wary of that car behind me, and the only reason being is because a lot of the hunters have opted for those cars, but it looks like we're in the clear, so we're all good. So I reckon he's parked it. I'm going to just literally just go here, you know. Go round. I reckon. It's behind this way. Oh, there's a police car, which to me indicates there might be a hunter nearby, so we might just want to keep our wits about ourselves right here. Oh, that's a motorbike. I think it's right there. Can you go inside? Oh no. Oh, that sounded like a car was coming then. Ok, 
Okay. Oh, I don't know these noises, you know. Okay, there is the soul town that I need in question. So. Let's do my grenades. Actually, what am I doing? Cops on the blind die. My god. Forgot the basic rules of what I'm doing. So we're going to have a little chill. Just going to keep me walking. Just keep me warm. I think. Hey, yeah, trucks are good. On? Done. Okay, cops on a blind eye. So, we're going to cock it. We're going to lob it. And we're going to watch the bad boy explode. Lovely. And now we're going to jump over the fence. And we're going to get to my vehicle as soon as possible. Oh, oh my god, these AIs are freaking out. I'm not going to do much heavy metal surviving in this thing, am I? I think I'm just going to keep moving. I can hear sirens. So it definitely means people are around in the area. I might try and add to the chaos, actually. This is something I've always thought of doing. I'm just calling the emergency services. And getting more cops to surround the area. Hello, this is 911. What emergency service do you require? Oh, break. Let's do please. Thank you. Police officers are oh. alert to your current location. Okay, there is a hunter right there. He's checking out those cars. Come on, please! Oh, he's moved on. So... Oh my god, there's another one. Are they all gone for green underglow, underglow to make it obvious for the chopper? I think they have. I mean, that's not a bad strategy. I've got to give them credit. Mm. Uh, so far, I've gone under the radar with this truck. So, all is good and well. I think we're going to go left here just to try and get away from the action of the police and everything. Yeah, we're going to do this. Someone in a... Oh no, that's the actual police. Liam killed Lucid. Oh, Lucid has joined. So we might have ten actually. So I might actually have gone up by one, which is always good fun. But I don't actually know where Lucid might have gone for his car. Anyway, still getting six. We've got one, you know, did it within the two hour blow uh, period where we could blow up. I think we're, we're good so far. Um, I'm, I'm happy. Happy with what we're doing. And uh, this big truck hauler thing has a... Uh, yeah, gone under the radar. Can't complain. There is this one by the arena, but I'm going to leave it just because I don't want to keep doing all of them near to each other, particularly as this is the furthest one south that we have on offer. So I want to try and ideally keep this one just to keep the spread of the hunters quite wide. Because as soon as I start clobbering myself and reducing the pool, the hunters are obviously naturally just going to gravitate towards where the cars are because that's where I'm going to be. And if I dunk them all next to each other... They're all just going to be sat in that little area. And it's going to make it very tricky for me. Uh oh. Nothing, nothing's going in front or behind me. So I'm just going to move. Hmm. I don't know whether or not it's worth me potentially just... Trying to move things along. Uh, I want to get hit the highway, ideally. No, not that way. Hmm, I'm trying to think. What's, what's, what's near me that I could go for? Um, okay, well, there's the highway, so we'll hit the highway in a second, which is perfect. It's exactly what I wanted to do, so. There we go. Lovely jubbly. I mean, there's these other big vehicles. Oh, there's a truck with logs on it. I want to do that. I want the truck with logs on. I want to steal that. <laughs> I want to be a logger. You serve me well, Robo Liqueur, but. Um, I found my next braz. Because I... No! Unless there's one right behind me. No, there's not. Oh. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. God damn it. Oh, I might do the, the logger thing. Ooh, later on. Or oh, tell a lie. Tell a lie, tell a lie, tell a lie. Woohoo! Sorry, dude. I know. Who'd have thought someone wants to steal logs, but um, 
Yeah, this idiot over here does. Mainly because I think... I mean, I might be incorrect here. But I... Oh, don't... Oh, what's it called? Don't... Something jack it, I think. I can't remember what the, the, the phrase is. Anyway, I think if I hold down left on the D-pad, I think it detaches the trailer. And in terms of other, what else I'm left with, I'm left with a Phantom, which is quite a strong vehicle. So I'm quite inclined just to stick with this. Um, I mean, we have the construction, little soul construction site, not too far away. And we know from the previous hunt, there's a back entrance. So I'm thinking I might just park this up on the highway, go through the back entrance, blow it up, come back out the back entrance and just hop back in this and start driving again. You know, let's see how I, how far I can go underneath the radar with these types of vehicles. And then in case I get in a chase, I'll drop the trailer, hopefully block an entrance, and then make my escape. I mean, honestly, in terms of a movie scene, you can see it happening, can't you? I think that's a hunter down there. The blue car has just gone underneath the car park. I might be wrong. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to just park it over this right-hand side. Hopefully, away from any sort of attention. Now what I need to do now Ooh. is make a perilous journey across the highway. So far so good. Yep, lovely, 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 lovely. Oh, no one else kill me please. No, thank you. See if any hunters are down below me. Doesn't look like it. Now we make a little entrance here. Lovely. Oh, okay, didn't need to do that. That was a bit extra. And then we go through here. Oh, let's go up the stairs. Let's be formal about this. I think it's on the other side of the building, so it's going to be a bit of a sprint. But I think we should be able to, to do this one and pull it off quite nicely. Yeah, here we go, here we go. As long as the person who placed the car has placed it in the same position again. He might have moved it, for all I know. And to be fair... Oh, no, not the gang members, no... Oh, let's just get let's just get out of here nice and quick. Cause it was then tell them in a second that I've started a gang. Okay, we're not gonna mess about. Cock it. Drop it. There you go, we watched it blow up just faintly in the background. Gonna just have my gun equipped as maybe that's the best thing to have. I'm hoping the truck hasn't despawned. I've actually come quite a way away. Did anyone come in through the entrance? I don't know. I'm I'm not sticking around to pay attention. Oh, actually, I actually haven't put any armour on. I should probably do that whilst I'm here. Cool. No interaction with any hunters, so it's alright. I can do that. No, I think it's despawned. No, it's not. It's over there. I see the blue. I see the blue. Come on, baby. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. We're... Oh, no. The trailer's despawned. God. Damn it. Oh, that's so disappointing. Why would the trailer despawn of all things? Oh, I should have I should have swung around and gone on the other side. Maybe it wouldn't have despawned that way. That's disappointing. Alright, well, you know what? We're going to swing around. I want to do the, log the logging thing. So, you know, if I can pick up maybe another one because they're spawning and all over the place, then I'll, I'll pick up another one. Otherwise, we're just going to have to stick with the truck for the time being, which is a bit frustrating say the least. Now because of my esca my uh, my axe of... I was, I was trying to say back then. My uh, what I did at that location last time I think the guys are going to be distracted with that 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 place for a little while. So I think I'm probably in the clear to just make my way and get another car pretty snappish. Oh I was thinking of jumping down there. What the hell happened then? I just completely went see through for a second. Hmm... What cars to go for? What cars to go for? I don't want to do a full lap, that's the problem. Oh, I'm not making that. I was trying to do a handbrake U-turn. Not going to happen. Alright, this is the Fast and Furious type handbrake turn I wanted to do. Ready, 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 ready? Skedaddle! Hit the brake! Hit the accelerate! Oh, not quite. Not quite. Vin Diesel wouldn't be too... He'd probably give me a 3 out of uh, 5, I reckon. It's like mediocre. It's not bad. But it wasn't great either. Okay, we'll car. 
Uh, we've got one in an alleyway up at the top road, which is a bit of an... It's a new location for us, so maybe I go for that one. Yeah, let's go for it. I don't know, I don't think you know, a truck <laughs> normally spawns around in that direction, but we'll give it a go. We'll see what happens. I am so gutted I lost the trailer, though. I really had intentions to just drop it, and I thought, oh, I thought I potentially had my eye eyes set on another one in front of me, but no, it's just a pickup truck, like, I don't know, whatever it's called, that thing. Oh, I don't know. Lorry. No, um, whatever. Doesn't matter. Oi, you're not indicating. Shove off. I'm in a great big vehicle. Behave. Jeez. If you wanted in the left lane, you should have scooched over sooner. You only have yourself to blame. God, some drivers, man. Definitely not an insight into what I'm like in real life, by the way. So, hang on, let me do a little tick update. So we got the one at the Strawberry Car Wash. We've then got the... The Little Soul Construction Site. So we're doing alright. Two so far. Not even at the halfway point. If we can get three before the halfway point, then we are on track to get the six cars we desire. I oh, know, some very janky turning. Honestly, if I could have a steering wheel instead, which means I could just... You know, smoothly turn left and right, I would do, but this is the best we've got. And because it's snowing, I'm, I'd rather twitch it than be, try and be smooth. So it's down one of these roads. I think it's... Oh, I can't remember where exactly it is on the map. Hang on, it's in Discord. Why don't I just have a look on there? Okay, here we go. Whilst well, we've got some time. Oh, it depends if it's in the exact... It's near the tattoo parlour place. Right, I'm just going to go all the way to the top. Like, I'm going to go towards the tattoo parlour and work my way from there. Don't overclock. Oh, I'm just casually running a red light. Didn't even think twice about that either. Oh, it's green. Yes, baby. Cops don't think I'm in a please stolen car. And get me, please. Just, just chill. It's all good. Nothing to see here. Thank you. I'm like a dead end alleyway, so I'm gonna have to leave my car. Oi! Jesus, what is up with some of these drivers? Thankfully, no one's seen that. No, no one's seen it. Okay, good. Well, he went on the red light, so I'm just following. Okay, tattoo parlor on the right. Well, which would indicate it's down one of these alleyways, so. Yeah, let's, let's follow these cars. Oh, whoops. Sorry. I got a bit too close. I got a bit too close. I'm not reversing it. I'm committing. Yeah, so Tattoo Parlor is back there. And then we're the... This next left. The next left beyond that. So I need to actually keep going. Okay, maybe I can approach it from this direction instead. Okay. I think it's potentially down the alleyway, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to just... No, oh, I don't know. What am I going to do? Down there? I think it's down there. Right, okay. Right. Pick a spot. Pick a spot, Jacob. Come on, make your mind up. Mate, come on. You can see a truck's reversing. Get out the way! There we go. Okay, there we go. Yeah, casually someone up here would buy one of these, wouldn't they? Okay, right, so it should be down here somewhere. Um, I think I'm in the right area? Or maybe not. Oh, no. I'm not in the right area. Oh, I think I know where I am. I think... Oh, I think I've gone past it, potentially. I think it's the... Other side of the street. So, right, we're going to just run towards it. I think it's potentially down there. So, we're just going to do a bit of jaywalking. Because, you know, why not? I think it's down here. I might be incorrect. I don't know. Let's have a little look. It's a dead end area. So. Oh, here we go. This looks like it could be promising. 
No. God damn it. Alright, let me have a look at the map again. No, it is. No, it was that side of the street. From the looks from the looks of it, it was this side. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So it's not like down there, is it? Oh my god, can Jacob find the car? This is the real question. It looks like a dead end area. No, but Oh, how much time can I spend wasting trying to find a bloody car, eh? Million dollar question. Thing hasn't despawned us. Well, apparently, so it's. Apparently, it is this way. Right. Right. Um. I cannot find this car at all. Alright, I've I've uh, wasted too much time, I think, trying to locate this car that I actually have no idea where it is, unfortunately. Um Huh. Was visited by the oh Liam, oh, he's got the the gooch on him. All right, okay, we've wasted yeah. an astronomical amount of time trying to search this bloody area. So let's move on. Find. Let's go for that car that's just down the street by the police station. At least we know where that one is. It shouldn't cause me too many issues. I don't think either. No, I was going to say it's not there. Parked over there, is it? Okie doke, that's a bit annoying. Um, actually there's the pain spray one right here, we'll do that one instead. Okay, we'll go do that. Hmm, a bit frustrating. How much time are we at? Uh, so we're nearly, at, we're nearly at 12 hours. It's recoverable, it's definitely recoverable. Um, oh, my right shoulder's actually killing me, I'm not sure why. Oh, that's so frustrating. I swear I had a good look at that map. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay, we'll have to uh, just scrap that and move on and go for the other cars instead. It's fine. We've still got plenty of time. You know, we get the next car, we're back on track. So, God, for those people who don't like on-foot gameplay, you're going to love that last few... <laughs> couple of minutes of <laughs> me just running around aimlessly um, trying to find it so in terms of we've got quite a few central still I think we go for those again so this one and then we go for either an ammunition rooftop or legion square next could even do some heavy metal surviving maybe and just go bang bang do one after the other that sounds like a good idea to me, maybe. Pick the pace up a little bit. We'll see. Come on, people. Let's get going. So, our car in question is in this car park on the left here. Just on that little ramp up there. So, kind of... I have a high enough point of view to see it. I'm not seeing it on my end. Do I just... I'm tempted just to drive straight in, you know. Go a little bit ballsy with it. Oh. Might have been one of them then. Um... This is part of it underneath, right under. I'm not seeing anything. Uh oh. No, I'm not seeing anything here. I think it might have despawned by accident. There we go. Shove that vehicle out of the way. Impromptu race pretty much gave that away, unfortunately. Um, 
Well, now we're just going to have to run in this, aren't we? There's no two ways about it. Come on, what are you going to do? You're going to try and bully me? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, okay. So it's been a while since I've been in a truck chase. But it's uh, it's uh, good to be back in one. And uh, the snow's going to make things even more interesting. As long as I keep the pace up in this, I should be good. Um, oh, there's another hunter who's now on me. Um, oh, I mean, they don't have the strength for me. That's the me that's the thing. I've got the strength. It's whether or not they can stop my car. That <laughs> that's the thing. That's the thing they've got to try and you know, that's not a task essentially. Whereas I can just shove them and try and maybe get them into some street furniture. Try and block them that way. But they're having a tough time of it. There we go. Get shoved off. Oh, going for a back wheel. That's sneaky. There you go. What are you going gonna to keep? Okay, right. We're going to see if we can go up. Hit the highway here. Hit the highway. There we go. Nice and tight. Oh, my God. How am I going to get out of this one? I'm not too sure. This is going to be a challenge. Oh, I was trying to push him over the edge then. Not going to happen. Oh, they are doing really well to battle me. Oh, I just need to make make sure they don't stop me or anything. There we go. In, <laughs> into the barriers for you, mister. Okay, we've got a bit of pace now. Let's see if we can try and use this and just follow the highway for a little bit. I mean, they're immediately going to catch up again. That's the only thing I've got to contend with. Oh, hit those brakes. Oh, he's gone! <laughs> okay, fantastic. Right, we now need to... Oh, I've hit the ramps by accident. I did not mean to do that. I... Oh, my God. Where am I going? Can we get out of this camera? Okay, right. Whilst they don't know where I am. Oh, my God. This might have been an, an accidental brilliant play. Sorry, Hydro. I don't know why you're chilling there, dude. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. Um, I think that was 100 just over there. Okay, let's see if we can chill out this way. Oh, I've got three stars on me. And I'm hitting an invisible wall. Anything will do for me right now. Oh, I killed him. Thank you, Dragon. I appreciate the vehicle. No, get in the car. Get in the car. Oh, why can't I get in the car? Uh, there we go. We'll just... We'll just... Triangle's not working for me. What's... Triangle isn't working for me, lads. What's going on? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No, you're nothing. You're no one. Oh, I'm going to have to focus on Lester at the minute. I couldn't do triangle. Yes, just let me get rid of the cops. How can I be of service? Okay. My no God. problem. Thank you. I'll get him off your back. So Dragon can't speak for an hour, but I'm not exactly getting away or far very quick. I, my, my triangle just wouldn't... I was spamming it. It wouldn't listen to it. Right, let's just get down here. Let's get off. Oh, bloody hell. I can't believe the accidental jump. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, God. I'm a bit... I'm not mad. I'm just a bit frustrated at that. There we go. Now it works. I couldn't steal those two cars. <sighs> okay. Well, that was uh, particularly hairy, um, <laughs> and a bit cut short as well. Do I maybe just go for heavy metal surviving a little bit? I mean, not in this, I don't think, actually. Maybe... Oh, they've blown my vehicle up. That means I've got an instigator chasing this thing! There we go, I'm instigating a chase. 
I mean, I bumped into you. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> He's in a Weasel News van, guys! Come get him quick! <laughs> oh my god, how stupid is this, eh? Oh, squeeze through the gap. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. Oh, wee. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can maybe do a hold up. Yep, we're going to go into this car park, dip, get out, and just start shooting, I reckon, straight away. All right, you want to have a... There we go. Thank you. Thank you, Hydro. Oh, my God. You happen to see me, and you're obviously the pilot. Oh, thank you for the car, I appreciate it. Problem is, I need now need to get this to a pay and spray. Where the car are the pay and spray? No way, have I just popped out in front of one of them? Yes, I have. Oh, that's going to hit me hard. Yep, there we go. How have I just popped out in front of him by accident? My god, man. Oh, oh this thing does not handle very well. Maybe that Weasel News van was quite a good vehicle to have gone for. Oh, I'm having to take these corners so much slower than I would have liked to have. Oh, the traction just isn't a feature. Oh, oh we. Okay, well at this rate, we are really slowing it down and the number of cars I can go for. It wasn't helped by the fact that the one at the top of the pain spray despawned annoyingly. Um, so heavy metal surviving is looking more likely. Oh my god, just got... Have I, have I lost the car? I think I might have lost him. So let's see if we can be cheeky. And maybe quickly spray a different colour. So we're going to go in. Do like a dark blue quickly. There we go. Keep the car, repair it. Um... Let's just go for a... Where, where's a blue? We've got like a nice blue we can go for. We'll go galaxy blue. Nice. I was thinking if we go too bright, I don't think I remember seeing many... Okay, that's fine. It's a different, different shade of colour. It's still dark, so... Okay. Ooh... Oh my god, he just drove past me. I'm sorry, I'm going to keep this moving. Moving, grooving. I don't want to hang around. Uh-oh. He's going to see the same car again. Going to be cheeky, going to be cheeky. He's gone up there, he's gone up, he's gone up there, he's gone up there. Is absolutely pumping. You know what? Sod the plan. I am bailing. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that might have been an AI, to be fair. <laughs> Wowza! That was close. That was really close. Yeah, I think that was an AI. Why? I think the person, the person who went up there was in a customized car, as in like they just spray painted a different color. They wouldn't have suddenly just bailed on that car for radius. Oh my god, I've rode my luck a little bit there. I mean, I always feel like with these hunts, you've got to have a bit of luck. If you don't have any luck, you're not going to get anywhere, but. I'm really testing hey, how lucky up? I am tonight. Uh, how can I help? Okay, that's not going to be a problem. Oh, I've, I've triggered this way too soon, haven't I? I need to get to the pain spray and the um, Elysian Square. Uh, Two AM start finish is getting close, and I've only done two so far. 
Mate, it is green. It is green. Oh, no, I just need to kick. I need to get moving. I've triggered that way too soon. I've got a bit happy with it. I know it's a bit risky what I'm doing. I need to get to my places sooner rather than later. I'm gonna keep moving. So this one at the ammunition rooftop is better off if I literally just go up there and chuck a grenade out. So let's get a grenade ready. I've not seen any hunters in a while as he then sees one. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm playing this too cool. Oh, yeah, that's why. My God, I didn't realise the police car was... Wow, that was a good little team up. I didn't realise the police car was... A player, I thought it was an AI. That was very clever until the police car decided to spin me out. And he's gone wrong. Okay, come on. Utilise the fact that he's gone wrong and see if we can now try and escape. Oh, there we go. He's gone on. Oh, beautiful. He didn't see me. Amazing. <laughs> no way. <laughs> God damn it. The timing. He's also got those um, off-road wheels on that thing as well. He's following me very loosely behind. Has he gone on by? I think he might have gone on by. Problem is, I've only got one headlight. And one rear view light as well. Oh, I need to bail from this vehicle. Sooner rather than later. Oh no, that's another one of them! Ah! I was trying to find a vehicle to swap into. God. This is frustrating. Oh, there's a vehicle I could have done with one of these earlier. Just trying to throw them off the scent as much as possible. He's still sticking with me. He's, yeah, there we go. He's gone. He's now going to have to make a guess as to which way I went. So hopefully he goes wrong. And as well. Oh, we're going to actually cut across the traffic too, which is dangerous, I know. I... Do we see a car racing on by? I'm not sure. Okay, come on. Quickly, quickly, quickly. quickly. Let's just get like for like, like for like, like for like. So that cop son of blind eye really was wasted, unfortunately, because I was given away by... Well... I was investigated. I think impromptu race came up, unfortunately. I could have held my nerve because... But I figured the uh, the cop car was just... Uh, it was an AI. I didn't realise it was an actual... Actually, one of them. It really tricked me. It was so weird. And all of a sudden, I looked behind me, and then there's a person with a yellow suit in the cop car. I was like, that's definitely not one of them. Oh, that's one of them about... Ah, uh, Legion Square, we're going to have to do some heavy metal surviving, but I can see them lingering. The problem is, time is running out. Oh my god, I've got two out of six. This is not... Uh, it's not helping the fact that I spent ages trying to find one, I couldn't find it, then I one despawned. So it reduces my pool from nine to seven. Uh, yeah, there you go, that's always going to be impossible. If they instigate a chase here as well, then I am done for. Oh, he's following me.
Oh, I'm just, I'm just not risking it. Oh, you have got to be actually. Oh my god. Okay. I nearly got absolutely. Oh, there's the police car. Oh my god. Oh. This thing just doesn't want to break. I have to break so early just to make sure I make the corner. Yeah, they're all in radiuses. Maybe that was the way to have gone for this hunt. Just because I can't get any traction. I did say at the start, didn't I? SUVs are the way to go. It's just I was worried about the pace. But pace isn't the worry when you need to make sure that you've just got the traction first. Oh my god. Make it, make it, make it, make it. The cop car is still behind me, I believe. Oh, actually, I think they might have. I might have lost them. I might have lost them. But my car is all damaged at the front. Yeah, because I got T-boned by a bloody. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do and I'm risking it by not looking behind me before I steal this car. Oh, there's a reason why. <laughs> they, they saw the abandoned vehicle and inspected that. Oh my god, that was one hell of a risky car switch. Okay, whilst we're all distracted going there, let's see if I can now do a quick heavy metal surviving double double there. I mean, oh my god, I've got two hours left. This is going to be... <sighs> I don't know what to do. I think this is going to be the first car park escape. We've got two cars out of... Well, you know what? No. No, it's not, Jacob. We're not going to let ourselves be defeated that quickly. Cock it. Oh, I think that just missed it completely. Yep, it did. There it is. There we go. It's gone. Can we get off quickly? We can get off quickly. Oh, right in front of the bloody police car. Of course. Bloody typical, am I right? Oh, this has literally just been the hunt of unfortunate timings. And that cop car is bloody quick. Gonna just throw in there some rights. Making guess I'm gonna break when I'm not. Oh, hit the brakes, hit the brakes, hit the brakes, Sunny Jim. There we go, down, down, down. Oh, yep, he's really having to hit the brakes too. So, having the cops on me might not be a bad idea either. Oh! Oh, what the hell is that siren for? Oh, don't turn right, thank you. Oh, let's turn left down here instead. Why not? That's the way we're going. Oh, they've all shot past, I think. Whee! Oh, if I could have made that second jump, that would have been epic. And I've totally... Oh, oh, he's made it. No, oh, I just said a bad word. Jacob Naughty. Come on. Whilst he's trying to recover that vehicle, let's make it get away. Nah, we're not going to do this. Unfortunately, we're going to have to do our first car park escape. Which means that we need to get off the grid and find a car to replace. Oh, he's, he's going down there. Okay, that's fine. Oh, oh boy. Okay, right. I say we steal this. Oh, I don't like 
got an hour left. I, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to car park escape at this rate. Yeah. Oh my god. This is the first time we're gonna do it. We've got three cars that we needed to get out of the possible six. I've never had this before. Normally, I've always managed to just have one car left to do last at the end, and three within one GTA is just not gonna do it. So. With this the first time we're entering this phase, I'm getting really excited because I've never done this before, so this is going to be something interesting. In basically, what now happens, but whilst I'm building up to it, is at 2 a.m. the guys would be told immediately which of one of three car parks I have to go and escape in. Um, what's it's dark actually? Maybe going in a bright coloured car wouldn't be a bad idea at all. What are they all? What are they all driving? They've been driving. Like, greenish cars. Anyway, they get told which car park I have to go up to the top of the car park and either jump off the top of it or um, drive off the top of the ramp section. That's either the multicolored car park by the movie studios, the red car park, or the strawberry car park um, opposite the, pay, um, the impound. I can get that information sooner, so I'll get it at 25 hours and then an hour to get, not automatically. I can get it sooner if I go to a paint spray and put spray it a bright colour which I'm gonna have to do I think so I'm gonna be ready to message Lauren and say about the bright colour car so let me just go to my messages I'm also trying to keep an eye out for the light going green um, there it is perfect timing of course so we're gonna go down here gonna find a nice colour to, to, pay, to paint and spray this We'll keep it fair. So we've got a little bit of time. Let me let me search up. Uh, da -da -da -da. <laughs> okay, right, we're going in. As soon as we come out, we'll send the message. Right, actually, you know what we'll do? Because it's going to probably take Lauren a little second. We're going to send it now. And we're now just going to do a quick respray. So. It's gonna be. What should we go for? Should we go for orange? Maybe that's the best way to do it. I've, I'm, my channel's all orange. Let's go for orange. Oh no, lime green. Lime green it with a red hue. Ugh, disgusting combination. Right. So we are waiting for confirmation as to which car park. Multicolored car park. There we go. Cool. Multicolored. Oh, that's the one all the way over the other side. Okay, we're just getting. You know what? We're going to have to full beans it on the highway. Now, the guys don't necessarily know that I know already. So, we've got two hours now. 4 a.m. is the limit. We've got to do this. Uh, I need to get down on the highway first. They now know this information. They are all going to be sending it there as quickly as they possibly can. Um, I need to get on. There we go. Now, thankfully, the beautiful thing about this is... Oh... I think this is just going to be a case of getting there, in there as quick as possible, really. Oh, you know what? Actually, before I even do that, I need to get I need to get guns ready. So it's going to have to be a shotgun. I think shotgun is the way to go, just to tear through them quickly. It's not the automatic one, which is like doo -doo 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 -doo. this one. I have to pull the trigger several times. I think so, at least. Um, I'll do that anyway. If not, okay, here we go. Whew, I'm feeling the nerves. We're going to have less than a GT hours to do this. So this is going to have to be a quick get in. See what happens. Maybe run up some stairs, I think. Oh, I don't know. They're going to be watching it like a hawk. We've not... Yeah, I, I mean, if in case you haven't gathered, we've not done this before. Right. <clears throat> okay. Whew. Feeling nervous. Can we do it? Let's see if we can keep in the car for as long as possible. Um... No. Right, okay, we're going into this. We're just about to finish. Let's do this then. Sorry, my brother's trying to get my attention and I don't need that right now. I'm coming in. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. No way. No, oh, there we go. I was always going to... I don't know why. Why didn't I just turn around and shoot him? Ah, uh, oh well. Hey, it was always going to be a struggle. Look, the whole point of this end game was if if the guys managed to stop me getting all the cars within 24 hours, then they get the advances going into the end bit. And that's the first time we tried it. It's a shame. Oh, <laughs> it just wasn't meant to be. Um, 
I didn't realise they were going to literally block all of my entrances, but hey, it is what it is. Um, well, fair place to them. You know, they deserve it. They've, they did well. I evaded them so many times, I guess it was only fair for them to have it swapped the other way around. I managed to squeeze through and then I didn't realise. <laughs> oh, well, I got out and I thought maybe I could just run around the corner and just keep running, but... He popped me in the head quite quickly. I must have been really low on health. But anyway, there we go. So if you have enjoyed this Survive the Hunt in the snow, then let me know down in the comments below. Let's see if we can get maybe a cheeky kill whilst we're in behind. No, we can't. Um, let me know down in the comments below. Uh, also, if you're new around here and you, you liked what you've seen, then hit the subscribe button too. Um, yeah, and uh, yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Oh yeah, of course, comment if there's anything you'd like to say or add to this Survive the Hunt. And until next time, this is JDB Gaming signing off, but he wants to sign off with a little bit of a kill, so let's see if I can go find somebody. Is anybody around? There he is. Got him. Oh, there we go, got the... Uh... No. Oh, no, there's a player over there. Oh, oh, it's a Yeti. Let's get finish off with a Yeti kill. There we go, got a Yeti kill. Right, thank you all for watching. JDB Gaming, out of Mundo. Perfect timing.